slavery never ended. It just evolved. And the plantation is still alive and well. And it survives on silence. So we, we're not allowed to complain about the things which really ail us. Um, especially us, black women and children, we don't get to complain about what really ails us. And especially if it's internal, we can't speak because then we're seen as trying to bring down the black man. I want to talk about your song from your new album, Silence. You have a line which says, Plantation survives on silence. Please elaborate on the message you were trying to convey with this lyric. Well, we like to tell ourselves so we're free now and we celebrate things like emancipation and independence where we don't have. Um, but slavery never ended. It just evolved. And the plantation is still alive and well. And it survives on silence. So we, we're not allowed to complain about the things which really ail us. Um, especially us black women and children, we don't get to complain about what really ails us. And especially if it's internal, we can't speak because then we're seen as trying to bring down the black man, you know? When the black man hurt us, we can only speak about the white enemy. We're not allowed to speak about the black abuser, you know? Um, when, 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 when a black man does something when he's young, them say, oh, he has his whole future ahead of him. You're, going to, you're really going to put this on him. Um, this is going to blight his future. And then him grow a little bit more and you want to talk about him. Remember, the victim is there suffering, you know. This person also have a future ahead of them, you know, which has been destroyed. I know them want to talk. No, you can't talk because he's in college now. And, and this is it's still his future you're going to mess with. All right? You try to talk later. Oh, my God, the man I get married. You can't believe you're going to really do that to him family. Oh, no, you can't speak. You have kids. No, why you got, what do you think this is going to do to him kids? And then him dead. And you try to talk and him be like, oh, my God, have you no respect for the dead? So when can we speak? And this is why this, the plantation survives. The slavery will never end. We are still being mauled. We're still being sexually assaulted. We're being abused in every shape and form. We're being victimized. They might take away things them from we, you know? Them are we pimp. Them have we a hook we out. And we can't talk. We have on muzzle. Every single last one we have on muzzle. Some of we muzzle have on some diamonds on it. So we think we're more special, but we muzzled. And we have learned to fight for each other's right to speak. Some of we talk and the rest of we try to shut up. Remember one time some, some um, survivors called some names and one of the bosses slave them get up and say, there must some cross, all crosses. Imagine I call the good man name. The good man rapes mad, you know. <laughs> all crosses. And so this, the plantation survives because we can't talk. A little boy will get molested, he can't talk. Remember, you know, he might go, he might go get ostracized and he, oh, God, film stigma go even bigger than Fui. Little boys, if any day we pull the bong there, you know, Jamaica was showing you know, that they dab their old back a lot if the little boys ever start talking. So this human farm keeps going because the culture of silence protects it. Well, let me hear you say, mountain, mountain.